now turn to developing moon news. You know the moon, right? That big round thing in the sky that sometimes looks like a cheese wheel or a cookie or a smiley face. It's wobbling, yeah, you heard me, it's wobbling like a drunk guy on a unicycle. Well, I'm not a wobble scientist, but according to a new study by NASA, the moon is going to cause some serious trouble for coastal communities in the U.S. in the next decade. You might be thinking, what's the big deal? We've seen high tides before. Well, the problem is that the sea level is also rising because of climate change. And that means that the next time the moon wobbles, which will be in the mid-2030s, the high High tides will be even higher than usual, and that will lead to more frequent and severe flooding in coastal areas. In fact, NASA predicts that there will be a leap in flood numbers in the 2030s, with some cities experiencing floods every day or two. So you might want to invest in some water wings or a submarine if you live near the coast, because the moon is coming for you, and it's not going to be gentle. So what can we do about this? Not much. Really, we can't stop the moon from wobbling or the sea from rising. But we can try to adapt to the changing conditions and prepare for the worst. We can also try to reduce our greenhouse gas emissions and slow down the pace of global warming. And we can hope that the moon will be merciful and not wobble too much. This leads us to wonder, is the global climate crisis just a regular stage of the Earth? We are certainly harming the environment with our irresponsible activities and Friday night tire fires, but are we the sole culprits? Is the climate crisis merely presented as a human-caused issue to soothe us as fragile creatures? Does assigning global warming to human factors give us a false sense of order and control in a reality that is governed by chaos? As the unavoidable occurs and most of this earth becomes inhospitable to humans, is it more frightening to admit we don't have ultimate control over our environment or to claim we can actually do something that would make a difference? Thank you for watching Limited Intel News Hour. Intro Spectral and Dimensional Travel for SVTV Earth Realm 369 Edition was provided by Magical Time Gravy and Limited Intel Podcast, a division of Limited Intelligence Earth Technologies. Limited Intel, we are what is behind every dissatisfied customer's frown.